Well, as many of us do our quarantine cleaning, you might come across a stack of old VHS tapes. Remember those? It turns out the last VCR was actually made about four years ago, meaning it's probably a good time to convert them before those memories might be gone for good. Matt shows us how you can do it yourself for under 20 bucks. Hey there, for so many of us, it's finally that rainy day that we always talked about, right? Cleaning out all the cabinets, everything we have, and along the way, we're finding some interesting things, right? Some blasts from the past, including these. Those of us of a certain age remember these VCR, these VHS tapes, and it's easier than you might think to convert those to digital. In fact, you can do it yourself. All you need, of course, is a VCR, and from there, two important cables. One, the RCA cable, which is the red, white, and yellow, and then the second one is the dongle. That allows you to plug that into your computer. That dongle is sold online, averages about 15 bucks. From there, you then download a program, many of which are free, that allows you to import that video and either burn it to a DVD or put it up in the cloud. Now, the bad news is, if it's a two-hour tape, it's going to take two hours to import. But this entire stack of VHS tapes of mine, going all the way back to high school, I was actually able to do this in two weeks. Of course, not everything had to be saved, and I was able to fast forward through a lot of things. But along the way, you find some interesting gems. This, for example, that's my internship there at WTHR just a few years ago. So the good news is, good news is you can find some hashtag Throwback Thursday memories all along the way. I've posted more information about the dongles, the apps, and everything you need to know, including how you can recycle those old tapes, all on WTHR.com. All right. And of course, converting audio cassette tapes is a pretty similar process to what Matt just showed you. We've also posted that guide in this story for you on WTHR.com. However, cassette players and tapes are actually making a comeback. They were actually for sale last Christmas in Urban Outfitter stores. But it's pretty sad, Julia, when you think the last VCR was made four years ago for so many of us. I mean, that was it back in the day, baby. You had to remove the little plastic piece to make sure nobody recorded over those precious home videos. <laughs> right. I'm, I'm wondering if you do want to do this, you've got to find one of those uh, VHS recorders, if, if that's even the case.